Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol HMNY. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. Real quick, what do I mean by 30 minute in case maybe you're new to charts? Instead of each one of these candlesticks here representing one day's worth of price action, which is what you would normally see, each one represents 30 minutes. So while this here may look like several days worth of time, it's actually today's price action broken down into 30 minute time slices. I like to this time frame, and it's a good job of telling the quote unquote story of the price and then makes mapping out where levels of support and resistance a bit easier to see. Did this analysis on Tuesday, so that is where the green line here is coming from. And this area down here uh, definitely still does pertain, but the, the current technical area that's stealing the show right now is all about that purple line. For So for those of you that have watched my past videos, you've heard me talk about this time and time again, being that being the 50 period moving average. And you know, from the big picture point of view, and this is not just pertaining to this chart, but just in, 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 in you know, technical analysis in general, whenever the price gets up above that 50 period moving average, then ideally speaking, as from a trend you know, perspective, you wanna see the price stay up above it. And so far, so good. I mean, this is just a thing of beauty right here. The price, I mean, if you were to picture this as kind of a wave right here, the price is doing a great job of just surfing right there on that wave. And as long as the price stays above the quote unquote wave, as that wave continues to increase itself higher and higher, because again, this is a moving average, so that purple line, the wave will keep getting higher and higher in the upwards direction. So yeah, again, as long as the price stays up above the wave and you know surfs the wave, then that implies that the overall trend is still perfectly fine. Now, even if the price you know does maybe wipe out and falls below the wave, that doesn't mean the entire chart is ruined because that's where we circle back here to this overall level of support right there at right around 0044. So I don't wanna come across like if the price happens to fall below that 50 period, then that means the entire chart is totally destroyed. That's not what I'm saying. All I'm saying is that what makes the chart look the strongest and healthiest going forward will be if the price can continue to stay up above that purple line as it's been doing right there. What about levels of resistance going forward? Initial area of resistance to keep an eye on going to be right up there at the 007 mark. So James Bond going to be that first key level of resistance uh, to keep an eye on. If the price can break up through there, then nothing up until up over 008. Uh, but for simplicity's sake, and you know, from the presentation standpoint, I don't want to risk causing cluttering confusion because I have annotations all over the place. We'll just take it one step at a time. So if the price can prove itself by getting back up above 007 James Bond and staying up above there, then you know I'll, I'll get some more levels of resistance mapped out. But as of right now, yeah, the, the price is looking great. And as long as the price continues to surf above that 50 period moving average, that's what you want to see. One of the biggest questions that I get is, hey Clay, how do you find the stocks that you trade? So what I've done is put together a free resource guide where I talk about the tools that I use to locate stocks that I find interesting and think may have potential. So if that sounds like something that could add value to you as a trader, then click on the image that is up on the screen right now and I will email you the guide. The guide itself is very short and to the point and best part, it's completely free. Thanks for watching the video. Let me know if you have any questions.